Hi, I'm Dervin from Dig It Excavating, and today we're gonna to take you through an aeration process where we restore a failing septic system. We're gonna take a probe and a lot of air, and we're gonna blast open a biomat, and we're gonna restore function to this system instead of replacing it. The Crossbuster here is a septic tank agitator. It stirs the tank before we pump it so that we mix the solids into the liquid well and we get the solids out of the tank. Basically what we're doing is we're uncovering the drain line so that we can run the camera. We can't see there's no T coming in here. Okay right here there's just a lot of liquids outside the tank coming back in the pipes. And so this is the reason he was having a backup the house is because the drain field was no longer taking and draining the liquid. Okay, we located one of the drain lines and it's just completely saturated. So what we're doing right now is we're pumping all the liquids out of the drain lines so we can get everything down so we can see what's going on in there and where the, each individual line is before we start our probing. have been located and they've been vacuumed out. We've marked everything, the complete field, so we know where to aerate next. upgrades we do when we do an aeration is we install an effluent filter and a riser right above it for maintenance. What an effluent filter does is it has these small slots in it and it keeps solids from uh, going out into your drain field and forming that biomat again. That was the cause of the failure in the first place. So we stick the filter in here and we um, also recommend that you disconnect any uh, softeners from going through this system. A water softener that's run on salt is gonna destroy the bacteria that's in your tank and it's all the discharge that comes from your softener is, does not need to go through the tank and it's just gonna overload the system. So that needs to be disconnected and run to its own drain or its own dry well or trench or whatever the health department recommends where you're located. We're gonna put the riser lid on and we are done. This basically takes you through the whole process of how we rejuvenate a septic system using compressed air. There is a cost savings to rejuvenating your system versus replacing it. And also, there is minimal disturbance in your yard. So instead of tearing everything up and putting a new one in, give us a call to see if your system's the candidate for rejuvenation. So call us at 269-445-7777.